Well, something's wrong. Where's Honey Bee Mustard? Why is it not on the shelves? There's something wrong. Honey, it's the best honey mustard, at, and it's nowhere, and I really need it. It's like when Graves Chow Chow went missing for a while, but they just rebranded it a bit. They changed the label, but I was scared. Because there ain't no Chow Chow like a Graves Chow Chow, unless it's homemade Chow Chow. Yeah. Oh, it's so long. Well, it's so sticky. Oh, it's just so sticky. Oh, it's so sticky. Okay, Who are you? Oh, I'm so sticky. Who are you? I'm Devastation. Oh, it's so sticky. This is Queen's ranting. Oh, Lord, I do believe I'm getting the vapors. <laughs> Bring me a dip of water. Hi, lady. <sighs> oh, Lord. Lord, Lord, when will the fire stop burning in a Baltimore? Is that what it was? Gone with the Wind? Is that what Trump was? Oh, it, was yeah. in, it would be Atlanta. Was it? It must be Atlanta. Yeah, I know the fire's in Atlanta. All right. <laughs> when will the fire's in Atlanta be out? I don't know nothing about birth of no babies. Oh, thank God, because I'm not praying. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Devastation. It was false. Queen Jack. I, I, I know, I was waiting for the moment. It was it's false. False? You is Negative! The test was negative. I'm not burning. Yes, I got that in the end, but I'm like, wait a minute, we're in Dawn with the Wind mode. Why, there was no pregnancy test back then. I, they probably like <laughs> spat in a rock and got some old hag to like pee on it or something. <laughs> this is Queen's ranting. <laughs> Grab the coat hanger, Millie. I need to hang up my dress. You all thought I was going somewhere, but I didn't. I wanted the rusty petticoat that what's her name wore. No, I didn't say anything. Don't say anything more. I was agreeing. Don't turn it into something. Then it'll go racist. And we can't play it. Don't do it. Sense of her. Hair's going up. You're not sweating as much anymore. We must be cooling down in here. It's because I had the vapors and I had a dip of water. I'm getting the vapors. And we'd have a little supper. Supper used to be Caesars on a Sunday afternoon before you put your face on, sitting in the bathroom and energy on. That's one thing that that power had going for it at a deep fat fryer. I was 400 pounds by the time I stopped working there. For the amount of Never mind, I can't talk. I'll pluck that out. <laughs> yes, Paul, we's in Canada. It's like saran wrap. It won't stick to the top of the cake anymore. Do you like cake, though? <laughs> Do you have a cake? No, I don't have any cake. I wish I did. <sighs> or banana cinnamon rolls. No, we don't have those either. Ugh. Oh, but we've been making, like, cold pasta <laughs> salads the last... Oh, my God. That ain't cake. I put on... It's a carb of some form, but it ain't I cake. Put on 15 pounds over carbs. pride. All you do is eat carbs. And drank. I was like, I, I stopped with, I was 183. I've actually before lost 20 pounds through pride. I wish I did. I weighed 183 so before pride started. I said, I'm not going to weigh myself whole pride. Ended, I was 197. I was like, what the actual f I just lent it to you. Don't worry. No. Oh, Christmas, it came out. I lost gone, seven pounds in two it. days. Water weight. Uh, yeah, I did. I had it a was really swollen. good poop. Just swollen. Really good poop. Swollen. That's because you had your cobwebs cleared the other day. Yeah, I did. Yeah. Blew them all away. Wait, colostomy? You don't want one of those. Never mind. Jesus Christ, girl. Uh, uh, what is the rage? word? Col <clears throat> Not colostomy. That's the bag on the side. Don't no watch that. Colonoscopy. Thank you. You got a self-homemade colonoscopy. Okay. And quite frankly, you needed it. This Colonos is what keeps her quiet. Can you start doing it once a month? Put it on the calendar. Schedule it. It's good. You know what I today like is? It. It's Tuesday. Yeah. That's right. It's Tuesday. It'd you know be what's happening like while that. you're watching this episode? Dev is getting it up the chuff. Okay, so speaking of things in my asshole, I had a colonoscopy. Vanity's once. up there. That's fine. Anyway, I had a no, colonoscopy. Like, like Shut up! This is good. I had a head of a colonoscopy with yes. a room full of students. Bench over this table. I've seen that porn. It was, and he's like, it's okay, students watch. There was five of them. And he took this big long thing, and it was cold. And I was like, okay, well, we're here now. Yeah, the okay. other guy at least put it in his mouth for Sure, hours. let's just go. It's fine. And he blew, oh, he filled me full of air. It's like... <laughs> I was like, yeah, it was, I said, I'm ready for my close-up, Mr. DeMille. Yeah, I bet you were. Actually, you know what? <laughs> it was a room full of doctors, girl. That's every homosexual bottom's dream. There was a time I had to have a little something burned off. It was very itchy. You should have said. It was inside. Let's just say that. Was it Paula? I don't know. Is it a they wart? kept coming back. Oh, it was, it was. It I had a, coming back? I had a time. Maybe you should get that check. Right I did. I got them all fixed. Oh, okay. But they what? had to do all up inside. Was and I remember pump? being put up in the stirrups. And I did. That was the last thing I said. I'm ready for my close-up, Mr. DeMille. Then they put me to sleep. And then I woke up at Zoe's. I don't really remember why. <laughs> it's just like going to the bathhouse, getting in the sling. Look, well, yeah. <laughs>
That's the same thing. She'd go up, she'd put her feet in the stirrup, she'd close her eyes, she'd wake up at the open. It's well, called you, Sunday morning. Well, you'd be hungry after that. Well, you, and nothing else was open at 7 a.m. So you went to Sophie's. Okay, I blame myself. You should. I blame the That's gonna be censored. We can't use any of that. Any of that. And now we definitely can't. My grandfather just rolled over in his ashes. I was thinking that exact joke today. I was gonna say something to her. I was like, your grandmother will roll over in her grave and she was cremated. And <laughs> yeah, do you know what that takes? A lot. A lot. I like it here. I so do too, it's nice. It's nice. It's nice. We made a whole lot of terrible comments though that you cannot use in any way. Yes, but the thing form. is, the episode I get to watch before it goes up so I can go, no. no. Listen, we're gonna cut that. I wasn't gonna do any of that. Oh, you... father, man, father, man, show no, no. us a sign. Sing producers. Your children have waited to see. Come gather together to greet the storm. The Fuhrer is coming. The Fuhrer is it's coming. coming. It's springtime for Hitler and Germany. I got a Gia Gun eyelash. Merciful Jesus, where am I right now? That's wrong. What do you have in your legs? You have your bare leg. I have panties. Yeah, you should go put those on. She's at the end of Pride and she's 21. I'm surprised you're walking. Not since the accident. Now you're Julia Child. That's Julia Child. No, now it looks like I'm holding my head. This would be a great one, bro. We have to start planning Halloween. You We're gonna push do me down the stairs. I could probably do that, you know. I'm <laughs> push me down the stairs. I know. No, but I mean, make like a hole in my stomach that like, you could reach. I There's a hole in my stomach. And now a warning. There used to be Madeline and Helen. Helena handbag. Helena handbag. I got her in drag for the casino. Remember? Yes. Um, I painted her before. Yeah. Yeah. Thank God. There was Helena handbag, and there was Madeline Hart. Yeah, and I her every well. time they'd walk into the bar, there would always be one there. I think they planned it. And as soon as the other one would see one, the other one would go, Mad! Hell! She's a bear now. Cute one, though. I'd do it. Hey, girl. Ginger Bear, who did I just segue? Okay. That was Connect Back. Okay. Energy. Ginger Bear. Energy. Gin Energy. Ginger Bear. What's his name? Darren! That was his name. Darren. Oh, Nanny! You Hi, didn't do Nanny, did no. you? No. 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 But he was dancing with us in the middle of the dance floor. Oh, he was and remember, out. the disco ball was partly in the ceiling because, mm -hmm. because the ceilings were so low. And he jumped and he hit the, the, the disco ball and it, it came and unhooked and bounced in front of him. It was the best night ever. Where are we? So let's get back on it. What were we doing? What's going on? What's happening? I gotta pee so bad. Then go pee, Mary. I can't. It takes me a lot to pee. I gotta get out. And I'm old, so my prostate doesn't work right. And it takes me a while. Your prostate doesn't work yeah, right? Yeah, I'm sure, it, I'm sure it's broken. Oh, I've already said. Listen, I've said to you guys, I, I have access to somebody who's on the dark web. You know, and I said, I want you to get me some cyanide caps. And I'm gonna keep them in a little sequin box. She's gonna get enough for the entire family, just so you're aware. Yeah. But the difference is, we're gonna let her eat her first. Sure. I have no fear of death at all. Terrified. No, terrified. No fear of death. Terrified. I've, no. I want my body put in a freezer, even my head up, put it in a freezer. Like what When it is time to thaw me out, defrost me, put me on a robot body, when it starts to break down, I will make sure to get it fixed. But I'm telling you right now, I need both anatomies so that I can be an amazing drag queen in 23,014. No. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'll, I'll live as long as I I got shit to do, yeah. bitch. Like, oh, the idea, the thought of it destroys my every ease. Really? No, I'm Hate good. It. What I if it's just dark? You're not. It's You're going to go on. Your energy is going to go back. You're going to be recycled. You're recycled. Yeah, but you, you don't the void. know when I've you're coming I've been in the back. void. Ah, uh, we've all been in the void. Yeah, and it's like, I love it. I was like, okay, I this like is good. I like to call it Vanity's ass. 
I think you can choose when you die. Oh, good, because I don't want to. I've only asked one thing. I said, the universe, I want to come back as a muscle god. I want to come back as Ilya Cohn. I want to come back as DJ Aaron Imbus. I want to I want to come back as one of those guys. I do not want to be a woman, and I definitely do not want to be a drag queen. Yeah, but you don't get to choose that. Yes, I think you do. No, that's no. the whole point of certain um, with reincarnation. No. Is that you come back to fix what you done did. If you, you let's face fact, if you were a muscle boy, you just f everything in sight and bake bad choices. Yeah. Yeah, no. Sounds like whole, fun. You've already been a touch of a muscle boy and then you put on drag and then you made bad choices. So, you're not coming back as a muscle god? Uh, did I call you a bad choice? No. Kind of. But that is because... It seemed like a good idea at the time. And there is why you're not coming back as a true full muscle god. I'm gonna come back as a true full muscle god, but I'm gonna come back as a humble muscle god. So that when like beautiful little men come up to me and tell me how handsome I am, I'm just gonna blush and go. I want to come back so gorgeous that people gasp. Do you know that guy in Saudi Arabia who got, he got deported because he was too handsome? He was a model awesome. or something like that, but he was so, oh my God. He was just like, well, there is only but one man. Well, other than Aaron Abitzer, but um, Sergey Constance. Oh my God. That man, he's a lizard person. He's got to be one of the lizard people because nobody is allowed to be that handsome. Except your wonderful partner who you love and care for. No, I married a Smurf. True. But I love him. He completes me. He doesn't oh know it yet. God, I just throw up in my mouth. Well, he does. He completes me. He's everything I needed. He's like, it's like Dr. Evil and Mini-Me. Listen, everything- That actually is a great analogy for you, Joe. What did you say again? <laughs> I called you Dr. Evil and her Mini-Me. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I could see you dancing like that to just the two of us. Can I have sharks with lasers on them? Yeah. Okay. If you could keep them in the back forever, you'd already have them. Right now, you just have beavers that eat maple. Yeah, it's not deep enough. There are sharks that are only little, they only need a little bit of water. Yes. Yeah, you just gotta figure out how to make it salt. <sighs> Looks like we have the season one filter on. I love her. I am so over drag. Oh my God, you have no idea. We have two shows till the two. I know. We have two shows and I have to be in drag again tomorrow. No, I mean watching and judging and I can't deal. Oh, I love judging. Oh my God, Even but I'm it's not. it's not a pageant. No. That's why I... we call it Bitch's Corner. No, I just can't deal with all the performances. They're all the same. It bothers me. But all they that's fucking the do is roll around the floor. I can't deal. No, but that's the thing. Neither of those Neither actually do fine. it. Fine. They don't do it. They really don't. And they both got good lip. What's wrong this with your hair? This one actually got the... Well, listen, I had it fixed and that's not where that part was, so that's fine. Of course she put it in the center because we just finished saying to her, don't put don't it in the do center. do that. A center part looks good on no one. No. Do you know what you look like when you have a center part? You look like a 70s porn star. With or you look like somebody who's in a cult in the 70s who's going to kill some actresses. You look like a 120 pound gay nose. You really do. We'll fix that before we leave. Which one? All of them. We're not talking about you. Let us talk about how that one is tucked. Uh, you mean not tucked? Even no. I'm more tucked than you are right now, and you're wearing a pantsuit. You're wearing a look, and you just took your belt off. You're wearing a suit that's three sizes too big for you. I'm wrinkled on the side. Your cock's out. I don't understand why your cock's out, because there's duct tape in this house. Number one. She wouldn't do number that. Number two. Like, oh, don't put your finger up in my face, Marlene. I've got a tight pair of panties on, and it is gone. Because I'm a grower, not a shower. Unfortunately, somebody else is starting to show. Because it's 5 o'clock and you still got shadow. But that's neither here nor there. The thing I need to talk about is the fact that your cock is so far out that it looks like your clit has been sucked on for the past 12 hours. And guess what, Marlene? It hasn't because you don't have a clit. You have your dick showing in your chuck. Are you doing a gender fuck? No. No, no I don't think you are. Are you doing full out fantasy drag? You're, no, you're not because you ain't nobody's fantasy right now, Martha. Not with that face, not with that hair. Not with this outfit. You know why it looks good on her? Because proportionizing. You know what's wrong with you? A lot. But that's neither here nor there. What we're trying to talk about is the fact that you look like you look like. What is this? A sash now? What did you win? Miss Zebra Print 2014? Because it isn't this year's win. And that's how it's done. And that's reading. That's not even shade. Do you want me to do shade? Girl, Zebra. That's interesting. Really?